experts reminding pet owners it is the time of year a lot of dogs can get scared, even try to run away. The reason all of those fireworks are going off around the 4th of July. Our Tori Mason live in Denver tonight. And Tori, some people think CBD may help keep our four-legged friends calm. They really do, and CBD is growing in popularity because of its possible health benefits in humans. And now, many of those humans say it benefits their pets, too. After talking to her vet, the owner of a very skittish dog, decided to give CBD treats a try and find a solution before the 4th of July. She's a little finicky. Meredith Gertis rescued Romy from the shelter. I don't know what happened to her in her past. According to the vet, Romy's life was likely... <laughs> A little rough. Laying stiff in the back of the kennel, shaking. Um, she was not doing well when we first got her. She says the noise from nearby trains makes Romy anxious. Right here, Coors Field, huge fireworks displayed. So a 4th of July night would put this puppy over the edge. Buell Dexter CBD. Meredith says a few drops of this. It's a local Colorado company. Takes Romy's edge off. Our vet is actually a huge fan of CBD. Um, it's the non-psychoactive component of the hemp plant. Romy's been taking CBD for a few weeks, and so far, she's happier with hemp. You can put it directly on a treat. 10 milligrams of these smoky-flavored pet drops... Good girl. ...makes Romy much calmer. She wasn't nearly as jumpy. Even social enough for the dog park. She's good. Meredith hopes a couple drops really will get Romy her. through the bangs and pops. She would usually be freaking out right now. I'm a, a huge advocate for CBD. It's been great for uh, myself and for Romy. Now, it is recommended that pet owners only buy CBD products that are specifically made for animals and that are tested. Now, the basic, the basic dosage rule is usually between 1 to 5 milligrams for every 10 pounds of body weight. But just like humans, every animal reacts differently, so you should consult with a vet before giving any animal CBD. We're live in Denver. Tori Mason covering Colorado first. Thank you, Tori.